have a stretch strap, grab a pillowcase or a towel because it's gonna help you go deeper into the stretch. Lying on your back, keeping your stomach pulled in, put the strap over your foot. You're gonna gently pulse this back. Remember, these are slow controlled pulses because tight muscles tend to resist. That pulsing is gonna help open it. Now, still keeping your back flat, you're gonna walk that leg out to the side. And remember, this is your stretch. Go only as deep into it as you feel comfortable. If your hip starts leaving the floor, you've gone too far. Gentle pulses, making sure you exhale. Now we're gonna cross that leg over the body. Warning, this is the stretch that hurts. May not look like it hurts me, but it is. Holding the strap on your foot allows you to really stretch this leg and do gentle pulses. Now you're gonna pull your knee into your armpit. You don't really need the strap here, so go ahead and grab your ankle or your heel and try to pull this down. Now, if you're not flexible, this is gonna be hard at first. Place your foot on top of your leg and you're gonna stretch your knee over to one side. Remember, you're trying to keep upper body flat on the ground. Try not to let it lift, but if you're tight, like I am today, you're gonna to feel this. Remember, pain is just weakness leaving your body. Now we're gonna open up the hips and thighs. You're gonna place that foot on your knee and pull your opposite hand, pull that knee back toward you, gently pulsing, trying to loosen it up. Remember, it may take a couple of extra sets to open up your hips if you haven't done this before. Be patient with yourself. Time for the other side. Stomach in, remember, back flat on the ground, gentle pulses. When you're tight, you're gonna have a tendency to hold your breath. It's really important that you exhale. Breath and breathing is what drives the move. Gently take that leg out to the side, stomach in, hip is flat on the ground. Remember, go only as low as you feel comfortable, and if your hip and shoulder starts to lift, you've gone too far, ease up a little bit. Let's cross that leg over your body to the other side, trying to keep your leg straight. But if it hurts, remember, you can bend your leg and straighten it several times just to give yourself a little bit less tension. That'll help your leg ease up. Now it's time for the knee into the armpit stretch. Pulling it down, making sure to exhale your breath. Remember, everybody's body is different, so come in only as deep as you need to, and you can use your hands to grab your legs to pull it in. Now we're gonna open up that hip. You're gonna put your heel onto your opposite knee and pull that back. But don't hold your breath. Remember your breath drives the move. Now we've got to get a little bit more of a hip stretch, so get ready for that one. This will get easier every time you do it. 